G'day, I'm Clive and welcome to CDP Outdoors. Just leaving the shelter and heading to Harris Dam. We've got roughly 14 kilometers today, which isn't too bad. So, see you along the track. past six and it's nearly light. I'm keeping the head torch on for now because it illuminates the warbles. Still has a walk. I'll probably be another half an hour before there's enough light to turn it off. But wearing your head torch even when it's low light is worth it because these warbles do glow in the dark. Or maybe uh, when your head torch hits them they reflect. So you can see them a lot easier and you can see them from a further distance away with them glowing with your head torch Instead of putting my down jacket on, I put my base layer on today, my thermal one. Much better than wearing the down jacket. Less perspiration, body's able to breathe more, and I'm at a pretty comfortable temperature. I feel good. Not, not overheating, but not really cold. So as long as I keep moving, I'll be good. I will. I'll be really good. Just walking through. A section of the forest now where the bushfires and you see all the regrowths. I still smell the fire, but the actual regrowth is coming on beautiful. All the green coming back. Uh, it's like this one here, look. all green at the bottom and the trunk all black. Give you a twirl around. All growing back.
well, whoever's following me, you're welcome again. Two spider webs so far. So, to be expected, isn't it? The first person down the track early in the morning. Time for a drink. Let's finish this one off first. It's pretty good. I've got incline at the moment, so a little bit out of breath, but nothing serious. Really nice day. Handy bit to get these up. The stash one litre hydro pack. When you finish with them, you just give it a twist, pop it in, put the lid back on, either throw it in your pocket or back on the carabiner like I am. It's out of the way, nice and small. Oh, a lot easier than using one of the plastic containers and everything so yeah good addition to the pack Three kilometres to go, and there's a hill. <laughs> oh, I've really been enjoying this one. I haven't really had much to talk about. Well, not as much as normal. But it's just a, just a nice little section, this is. Even though we've got this hill. <laughs> but yeah, still enjoying it. Still just beautiful out here. black cockies again. Can't quite see the white tail or the red tail or what. It's always nice to hear them. About one kilometre away from the shelter now. So my feet are burning. But that's okay, feeling good. Head up, shoulders back and carry on. There we go, there's the shelter, straight ahead of us through the trees. Pleasant sight. <sighs> Made it to Harris Dam. My feet need this rest. It's taken me roughly four hours to get here today, and that's stopping doing the filming and the uh, taking the photos and everything. But it was a nice walk. I never had much to really say, I know I've babbled on about different things, but it's one of those bits where you just want to walk and be quiet and just enjoy your surroundings. Yeah, there's not much more I can say apart from I hope you've enjoyed the video and if you have, please go down below and click on the subscribe button, click on the notification bell and then click all, and then click the like button, share it with all your mates and family. And if you've already done all that, again, I thank you very much. So until next time, get out there, have some fun, and take care.